Guys, I just came back from Zion National Park and I got these incredible photos. I want to show you some of my best photos, but there's one mistake I see a lot of people doing. When I was there, there was a lot of students that were doing always the same mistake that can totally ruin your photo. So let's go. Bonjour, mesdames et messieurs. My name is Serge Rameni. I am from the amazing, the incredible city of Paris, France. And I make two tutorials per week, so make sure you subscribe. First, let me show you how I actually work. So this is the entrance of Zion and I just reset the photo and what you can do is, you know, you can take the time to open the shadow, bring down the highlights. You know, you do a black point hold, by holding the option key and the white point. Then the photo is kind of boring. So what you want to do is maybe change the white balance. I'm going to make it a lot warmer and a lot more red. And uh, that's kind of cool, but I, I lost, it's a little bit too magenta. I lost the sky. There was like a nice sky. Where did it go? So let's see if we can bring it back. But first, let's add a bit of contrast. Okay, and let's bring back, let's go also to profile and see if we can use like Adobe Landscape. Yeah, Adobe Landscape is going to make it better, but we still lost all of that. Okay, and uh, the problem is that often your eyes adapt and you don't know if you go too far. Like I see a lot of people doing, adding a lot of vibrance, a lot of saturation, and it just looks fake at one point. I mean, it is beautiful, but it's not that beautiful. So one thing I'm going to do on this one is I'm going to add a gradient here. And then I'm going to add some yellow and some saturation just to make that come back. And, uh, and voila. And some people, what they do is they add a lot of clarity and a lot of vibrance. It looks cool, but it's like the problem is that if you do that, when you show your photo, people are going to say, hmm, it's nice, but you photoshopped it. And you don't want that. You don't want people to say you photoshopped your photo. That's the biggest mistake. But you know how I do it? I have this AI preset. Check this out. I'm going to go to golden hour. Look at this. Or sunset. Look at this. One click. And I got all the sunset back. All I have to do now is hold, is use the alt key and the white key and I'm done. Look at this. I just have to take, I just have to erase the dust spot. I got a lot of dust spots. Boom. Look at this. One click retouching. And check out this photo here. So this photo actually originally is three photos. One two, three, okay? And this was sunrise. I, I take it, photo merge, panorama, because I was not wide enough to get everything, and I'm gonna use fill edge, and I basically get this result here. And same thing here on this one, I'm gonna use preset, sunset preset, I think is good. Look at that, one click, isn't that crazy? And then all you have to do is check your black point using the alt key, and the presets you can them for free under this video, by the way. And also, when, once you get a preset, I'm going to try to sell you my latest training. Use the code YouTube on the checkout if you want to have that. You can get a preset for free. I'm just going to send it to your, to your email. But then I'm going to try to sell you my latest training on camera settings, on composition, on Lightroom. If you use the code, keep this, it might not still work. But if it does work, try to use the code YouTube on the checkout as a coupon code. You will see you can add YouTube as a code at the end of the checkout. And then you can get 50% off. It's crazy. Anyways, so now, look at this, just one click. Oh, let's see what else can we do with Zion. Like people ask me, how do you really work? I use my presets all the time. Like I'm very lazy. I just go here, golden hour, look at that. Sunset, ooh, sunset is even better. This was a sunset. You know, I just, all I do is I check my alt point, I check my white point, and that way I know I am right on the money. Like. I'm not like this. I don't have clarity all the way. I don't have vibrance away. I don't have people say, oh, it's beautiful, but what did you do? No, I don't have that. I know my presets are right on the money, and I've used them. I've tested them. I have tested this preset with over three, 400 different photographers, like Nikon Photos, Olympus, Sony, Leica, Fuji, even Hasselblad. This preset work on every brand. You know, and you just add a bit of contrast. I mean, look at this. One click before after. Isn't that crazy? So get the preset and get my training if you can. Oh, and by the way, if you want to get feedback from me on your work, I'd love to see your work. Book a call with me. I freed up just a few spots next week. Maybe we can talk and maybe I can coach you one-on-one -on -one and make you an award-winning photographer like JT who got 38 international awards after I coach him. So book a call and let's talk. And I hope you get my preset. They're free. Just get them.